and motivated learners always faithful to our loving God. We acknowledge the traditional owners and caretakers of this land on which we are gathered and pay our respect to the elders both past and present. August the 8th is the feast of our Australian Saint Mary Mathilde of the Cross. Let us pray. Loving God, Mary McKill spread the message of our love to all those she met. May we try to follow her example. Lord, hear us. Lord, hear our prayer. Loving God, Mary McKill showed the great courage when things were difficult. Make us strong with her with courage too. Lord, hear us. Lord, hear our prayer. Loving God, you chose Mary McKill to do your work. Help us know that each one of us can make a difference wherever we are. Lord, hear us. Lord, hear our prayer. We are going to have a poster competition. Design a COVID safe poster. Email Miss Hawkins and we will share them at assembly. Remember to stay COVID safe. Now we invite Miss Hawkins to share, to share the awards and then Miss Trot to draw the house points. Thank you to Matilda and Lainey for leading our assembly this week. We are in stage four lockdown. That means that we have to make every effort to reduce the coronavirus cases. And when that happens, we'll be able to get back to school very soon. So I know and believe that we can do it together. We can make a difference. So stay safe with your families. Let's get through this six weeks together. The following students have shown how they've engaged positively with flexible learning. From Prep Y, Sebastian Bailey. Prep A, Joshua Bedford. Prep HB, Marcus. And Marcus has also been focusing on learning his Oxford list words. From 1K, Ali. Congratulations, Ali. 1H, Matteo. Matteo has also been showing great interest and excitement when learning about animals. From 2V, congratulations, Abigail. From 2MP, Cecilia. And Cecilia was a great buddy for Akira when she had a short transition visit to school. Congratulations to, to Emily in 3D. In 3L, well done, Michelangelo. In 4O, congratulations, Isabella. 4RM, congratulations to Jake Williams. In 5J, Harper Kelly. In 5S, Matthew Esposito. 6G, Leo Cerrito Dillon. 6L, Finn Cromie. And Finn has also been participating well in his small group Zoom sessions. There's an extra award this week from Mrs. O'Dwyer for music. And congratulations to Mitchell from 1K for his imaginative response to the music Hens and Roosters. And there's also an award from Miss Trot for Gracie Cardile. Grace has demonstrated excellent balance and shapes in PE and trying to do her best. So well done for the efforts that you have made during flexible learning. Congratulations. And now it's over to Miss Trot for the House Awards for this week. Hi guys, how are you all? Um, our house point system is going to work a little bit differently this term. Um, as you can see, I am not at school, and neither are you. So we will be um, drawing out house points as per usual, but I've got a little bit creative today and um, I'm gonna use some colored things that I've got around the house. So first of all, well done. Um, to everybody who has gone in the draw this week, your teachers have been emailing me um, with students 
deserving um, and portraying one of our core values. And I have put them into my own little boxes at home. So we will be still be doing the draw each week. So keep following those core values, keep being positive, um, and hopefully we'll be back at school soon. Okay, so for Grabo, gold today. The winner is going to be from Prep Y, Aiden Musket. Well done, Aiden. Um, from Green, got myself a green beanie here. Don't worry, it's not mine. Um, for a greenhouse today, the winner is from Prep A goes to Zoe MC. So well done, Zoe. That is for green for Bainbridge. Also another cute little hat. I think this is my Nana's, this one. Um, the winner for Bainbridge this week, also from Prep Y, goes to Sophie. Well done, Sophie, in Prep Y. And lucky last, we've got Rivera. The winner today is in year three, Bianca L. Uh, in year three. So well done, Bianca. Well done to our winners and everyone who went into the draw this week. Thanks, Miss Trot. Congratulations, everyone. Just email me to find out about your awards. This is a new segment now. Stage four lockdown birthdays. Happy birthday to children who had their birthday on the 6th of August. Congratulations to Lila in 5S, Sophie in 4RM, and Millie in 1K. These children had their birthdays on the 7th of August. Luke in 5S, Eli in 4O. On the 8th of August, congratulations to Hamish in 6G, Mac in 5S. On the 10th of August, congratulations to Sienna in 1H, and Philly is the 11th of August, Prep A, Peter, the 12th of August from 1H and Tate the 13th of August from Prep A. Congratulations to all of you and I hope you are able to celebrate your birthdays in style. Thanks to Lara's family for sharing this special photo of her birthday celebration. Email me your lockdown birthday photos and I will share them during our virtual assemblies. Hope is our St. Pat's Morumbina theme for 2020. Let's continue to pray and hope that we will get through this lockdown and be back at school very soon.